New crewmates on the International Space Station and for the stranded astronauts, the arrival of their ride home. Perhaps an additional reason for Butch and Sonny to celebrate. The SpaceX rescue mission was launched from Florida with just two astronauts on board. The other two seats kept free for the extra passengers when it returns to Earth in February. It is a coup for the company, but an embarrassment for Boeing, which is still trying to work out why thrusters on its own Starliner capsule failed as it docked in June, leaving the test pilots marooned. Lots of cheering here in the room. Butch and Sonny arrived at the space station in June for what was supposed to be an eight-day visit on the test flight of the Boeing Starliner. There's Butch coming in through the hatch. But that's become an eight-month test of endurance as they wait for the scheduled return of the SpaceX capsule to Earth next February. I miss my two dogs. I miss my friends. But you know what? Like Butch said, there are so many people... Uh, on Earth that are sending us messages and it, it makes you feel just right at home with everybody when we're able to have those conversations with our friends and family. The Starliner was returned to Earth empty earlier this month. Its development has been a nightmare for Boeing. There have been helium leaks, a safety issue with parachutes and the discovery that tape used on wiring was flammable. But NASA needs the capsule certified as safe to fly as a backup to SpaceX. Whenever you've got a complex system, and that means a, you know, a rocket, a spacecraft, but also a business, a political environment, all of those things mean that you need resilience to, to change. And the best way to do that is to have two entirely different transport systems developed by two entirely different companies. Boeing insists Butch and Sonny could have safely returned on Starliner, but NASA wasn't taking any risks, not least because it needs public support for a new generation of moon landings in the next few years. The aerospace giant's reputation has taken another knock, and there's still no plan on when it will return to space. Thomas Moore, Sky News.